Joseph makes some of his income from his cabbage crop. And first up, we have an expert from Sigenta. The farmer is doing very well, but he's facing some challenges on diseases. Mm -hmm. if, you, if you look at these leaves, you can see a lot of spots. This disease is called ring spot. Ring spot. And it's commonly affecting his cabbages in this farm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What causes it? This is caused by fungi. Uh, fungi are commonly spread during the, 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 when the weather is a little bit wet. The leaf will completely turn like this. Wow. And when the leaf turn like this, mm -hmm. it cannot manufacture any food that will form the, help to form the head of the cabbage. Mm -hmm. Automatically, the, the, the farmer will start harvesting underweight cabbages because of this. Oh yes, do you have uh, a cure to these uh, problems? This product is called Otiva. Okay. We are using this product for protective purposes and we usually spray this product when the crops, your cabbages, are not affected because it, actually, it will prevent the disease. You use 20 milliliters in 20 liters of water, which will cover a quarter of an acre. But once the cabbages are grown, you use a product called SCO. SCO is a curative. Curative. That, curative, that curative. means oh, yes. you can see the, the, the rings have already started forming. Mm -hmm. If you spray this product, it will not cure this, mm -hmm. but it will prevent the spread. Of oh, the spread. The spread. Oh, yes. Like this one. You see? Yes. It started as a small, but mm. it has already spread everywhere. Remember, when using any chemicals for spraying crops, always read the instructions and wear protective clothing. There is also another solution to preventing diseases, a new seed variety. We are having Quisa F1, uh -huh. this cabbage. Okay. Uh -huh. It's quite resistant to this disease. How does a farmer get this? They are available in the, in the, in the, in the shop, Agrovet, within this region. Joseph, mm. what do you think? Are they, are they very expensive? <laughs> not really. Mm. Yeah, they are not expensive in terms of what you will get because they are resistant to diseases. Mm. And the uniformity, the shelf life, even the color. And actually they are resistant to pests and diseases. Okay. Uh, okay. So at the end of the day, ah. a farmer will benefit.